Now, watching this story, you know, Judy Garland's life and seeing her get out there again and again and, you know, performing and always being on. Now, is that, you know, does that speak to her level of professionalism or is it really just all she knows? Oh, I think it's her joy. I think that she found so much joy in her connection with the audiences um, that, I don't know, it probably propelled her. And now you going into her life and, and looking at all these different aspects, anything that really stood out for you that, that maybe maybe even shocked you? Yeah, I was surprised to, to, to learn that she was medicated as a child and that that sort of set the trajectory for her life going forward. And I also didn't know that it really surprised me that a person who had been working since she was two years old um, on the levels that Judy had um, could find herself um, facing financial challenges later in life. Yeah, and, it's, and there's a, a great line where she says, you know, I'm Judy Garland for an hour on stage every night, but the rest of the time I, I just have a family. Now, do you find, you know, the more, the more success, the more, with the more fame, you, you risk losing yourself in it all? Um, I don't know. I mean, I can't speak to other people's experiences, but I, I, I guess, well, there's some truth to that when it comes to what other people perceive. Um, because the bigger your persona, the bigger the shadow you stand in, I suppose. Mm -hmm. And uh, I got to ask too, though, the wardrobe, very uh, amazing. Did you end up with Pretty any of that neat. in your personal closet at home <laughs> at this point? It wouldn't fit. It oh. only fits when I stand a certain way, so. <laughs> so. so bad. It's, it's really, beautiful, right? It is very yeah. beautiful. Jenny, to me, she does beautiful work. And you know, when you're, you know, you're out, like you know, like like, like Judy Garland was, you always have to be, you know, on and, and be, you know, perceived a certain way. Is it is it is it kind of? I, mean, I feel like it's got to be exhausting at the end of it all. I don't live like that. You don't? No, I think of Marilyn Monroe's experience in that way, but I didn't. No, I didn't come into the business that way. So. I've never felt that there's something that I need to sustain in terms of the illusion, you know? The illusion is my job. And that's me right. am, you know, a baseball hat and some sweats. <laughs> that's awesome. I think that's really what this movie is really going to do is really kind of humanize it. I think people tend to, tend to see performers and actors and you know, people like Judy Garland in a certain way, but really knowing that we are all people. Who go home at night to whatever our circumstances might be.